You understand? But we, we have had a recognition of Ghana Music Award. We played on the VGM stage. I don't know which stage you can play on Ghana again to be seen as mainstream. So you're okay with with the coverage you have now? We we every human being is on Oliver Twist. We always ask for more, and we we'll keep asking for more. And I even think the bigger artists you consider are still asking. Because when they conquer the Guardian stream, they're looking out for streams out in Africa. So there's no stopping for art. When you're an artist, when you get a hundred thousand, you want five hundred thousand in following. You know, and when you when you can make when you can live off what you're doing, then you're successful. You know, success is another definition. So I am defining mainstream as as a, as some media success, and I think we have made some strides as a band. You know, as a as the only rock band in Ghana doing rock music, it it it's, it's a step in the right direction. Oliver Twist, I have to ask. <laughs> you. Okay, so as far as I know, you are perhaps the only rock band in Ghana. Where shall we put you? When you are for the Ghana Music Awards, for example, you see what you what, what we just did right now have exposed a certain flaw in our Ghanaian music industry. Because the truth is that when you have people in the music industry working around an industry, you cannot say I'm running a construction company and you don't have every element of it. You know, the music industry is music industry, and you cannot kick jazz artists out. But we don't have that category. You know, even dance. Years back, we didn't. So it is more populist. They wait until some people struggle, like we are struggling. I remember Shatawale as Bandana, you know, and all these stone boy and stuff. People were saying dance hall is Jamaican. And dance hall is Jamaican. Today, people forget dance hall is Jamaican. They act like dance hall is Ghanaian. And now they, they, they embrace the dance hall artists and say, oh, you rockers, you are, you are strangers, you are foreigners. Even High Life was Afro Cuban. You know, before it came, there was a general music except that it was seen as foreign, but now we call it Ghanaian music. So it just means that we don't have our industry together. And I think that in these kind of interactions that we're having, people like us coming up, encouraging jazz artists to also come up, they will always start making that demand and the industry will keep growing. You know, so even our industry is not mainstream. Okay. Um now you I, I imagine that you know the band um 